Hi, this is Paul. I want to make a quick video about uh, Merrick Garland, the Attorney General, appointing a special counselor, uh, um, Jack Smith, for the uh, Trump investigations, the you know, January 6th thing, and plus the Mar-a-Lago you know, classified documents uh, prosecution. We know all what's going to happen. You know, Republicans are going to whine and bitch, and, and that's and again, Trump did this. Trump knows that that's why he's announced. He made a stupid announcement that he's running for president again because he figures that. He figures that in case of the department, or he thinks that that, that maybe maybe he thinks the investigation is going to last, you know, way past the ele excuse me the election, or he thinks that that he thought before that uh, Marilyn Garland wouldn't charge him, or or even the special uh, counsel ain't going to charge him, or he can lie on a campaign trail and say, oh look, and they're targeting me, they're targeting me, they're targeting me, and. Let's face it, the idiots that believe in them are going to believe it anyway. They, you know, you can't change minds. And we know these these lapdog Republicans are going to try to run with that and say, oh, yeah, oh, they're, they're targeting Trump. Uh, you know, whine, they're whining, bitch, and complain they, like they always do. But it, it doesn't matter. They can't because if anything that, you know, these things have taught us that they're going to, they're going to whine and bitch and complain anyway. It doesn't matter what you do. Even if Merrick Garland actually prosecuted Trump or, you know, did continue the investigation, you know, he's doing it to, to try to isolate, you know, the Attorney General's office by saying, let the special counsel to do it. And it's supposed to be, you know, it doesn't matter. Republic, if you did it or the special counsel announced criminal charge against Trump, they're going to whine and bitch and complain about it anyway, saying it's unfair, they're targeting him and all this stuff. They're going to bitch. Their corruption, their corruption doesn't, they have no conscience anyway, so it doesn't matter what you do, okay? And like I said, hopefully this guy, this guy's investigation doesn't take it shouldn't take uh, more than a year because uh, th th that um, January 6th committee basically laid everything out for them, to be, be perfectly honest. They laid everything out. Okay, this investigation should not take uh, two years or so so to solve, okay? Because, it, trust me, most of the evidence is already out there, okay? So, and at the end of it, they he definitely should be charged, okay, and prosecuted, okay, and convicted because he's a criminal, okay? A criminal doesn't care about anything but power, Okay, that's all he cares about is power. Okay, he, but he's he's a blatant criminal. Exactly. And all these people that try to overlook what he does and stuff, and it's because you know they like to be close to power and stuff. But don't don't go don't fall for it. Okay, he's a criminal. Okay, a criminal who should be prosecuted and thrown in jail like he's supposed to. Okay, like I said, the special counsel. Hopefully, like I said, he will do his job. And okay, and wrap have this wrapped up in a, in in six to. Eight months. I don't think he, it, it should even take that long, to be perfectly honest, because January 6th can be already laid it all out for you. So you, you should just go ahead and, and do it, okay, and just let it be done. So my hope is that, you know, go six months or so, whatever, but then and then indict him and charge him, okay, and have the Department of Justice charge Crump with criminal charges for the January 6th uh, insurrection and for taking the classified documents. He should be charged and criminally prosecuted, okay, and thrown in jail. Okay, that's my whole feeling on it. So, whether they appointed the special prosecutor or not, at least Merrill Garland get, got off his behind and, and do something. Because people were waiting, saying, "Why are you not doing anything?" And I think he even made a video of Merrill Garland, "Do your job." Okay, so finally, there's going to be some movement on this, and hopefully, there will be criminal charges referred to him and him indicted and charged and indicted. Okay, okay, and convicted. That's my hope on that. Anyway, let me know what you think of all this special. Uh, prosecutor, uh, independent counsel being uh, indicted for Trump to probe his crimes, his obvious crimes. What do you think of it? Feel free to leave comments down below. I have links to my social media in the description box, Facebook, Twitter, Instagram. I also have a link to my main channel, Trey Passer, in the description box as well. Also, I have a link down below to my uh, my patron, and I want to say a special thank you to my patrons. Their names will appear in this video somewhere. I want to say thank you to them for supporting me. I always have my back, and again, my patrons only $5 a month. I have tons of unedited uh, TV show reactions on there. I got DC shows. I got Marvel shows on there. I got all four parts of Zack Snyder's Justice League on there. I got The Boys Season 3, uh, Obi-Wan Kenobi, The Book of Boba Fett. I got anything from WandaVision to Loki to Hawkeye to Moon Knight to Titans, Doom Patrol, Superman and Lois, The Flash, What If, uh, Moon, uh, I said Hawkeye, uh, She-Hulk. Follow the link below to the Patreon. Check it out. Only five dollars a month. Also, please give this video a thumbs up. It helps the channel, and I truly appreciate it. Also, hit the subscribe button. Hit the notification bell so you know when I upload new content to this channel. And this is Trey Pat. Oh, not Trey Pat. This is Paul saying so long, and take care.